Welcome back, everybody, to Walking Dead, the definitive Telltale edition. Well, we just got done talking to uh, Chuck over here. It's been a while since we've played this game, so I'm kind of getting back used to it just a little bit. And we're we're getting close to, uh, I believe, Savannah is where we're at last. Hey, it'll be good to get to the water. Um, you know, I just remembered... It's been a while. I just remembered that I've been playing this game on my control, so, uh... It's still the best plan. Okay. It's the best plan. Uh, now, uh... <clears throat> let's see, uh... Okay. I'm gonna try to talk to him again, because, uh, I didn't hear what he said. Any maps in here? Maps up here. I don't know. I just, uh, want to look over one with Clem, so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Yeah, okay, cool. Well, that looks like a map to me. It's full of maps and documents. <laughs> okay, how about if we take that? By you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? Oh, well, I just want to grab the map. Mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. <sighs> I mean, can I just grab it? Like, seriously? Can I? <sighs> I'm going to have to walk by him again. Get out of here. <laughs> Do I just keep on trying? Kenny, what's up, dude? Uh, listen. You still want to get a boat? Still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Okay. It's the best plan. I mean, it's a pretty good plan, to be completely honest, I think. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Okay, well, I, I can't get that map. It's, it's, it's bizarre, but I can't get it. I just can't get past Kenny. It's right there, but I can't get it. Should I just hit him with my wrench? No, I don't. That doesn't seem like the best idea. Let's go here and talk to Chalk. It's annoying. I can just grab the map. I can just grab it. It's on your mind. Well, I need him. I need to move Kenny. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. That's you said it. Kenny's kid, man. That was a heartbreaking episode. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. I've got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there. They just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. <laughs> Be safe up here. <laughs> I bet you. Okay. Well, so, uh, I mean, I, <laughs> I feel like I've explored all two options that I have here. I can't. Is there another place I can leave? I was lucky enough to get it working once. Yeah, okay. Oh, I can go out this door. Maybe you need to go talk to Kenny's wife. Uh, oh, here. What, what's uh, what's Jabroni here? What, what's he say? Hey, Ben. Ben. Hey. Uh, Carly didn't have to die. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you going to be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See you. Yeah, okay. I I, I, I wish we saw Carly and not Ben, to be honest, but okay. Door to the boxcar. Yeah, it is the door to the boxcar. Okay, let's go here. Hey, Clementine, how you doing? I haven't talked to you in a little while. It's been like a month since I recorded. I mean, it's been a few minutes since uh, he was over here. Him? I did. He had some... Uh, he explained himself and made some let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. Uh, let's go here. To know how to protect yourself. 
like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. The aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? <sighs> <sighs> aim for the head. These are just bottles. But you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. Might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Okay, uh, oh man, I can't, I don't know, where, is she aiming in the right, how do I have no idea? Now keep it steady. I think aim higher, keep maybe a little bit? Higher. No, that's too high. Uh, aim right Get a little bit? Right. Okay. Aim a little bit lower? Lower. Got it. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Okay, cool. All right, are we gonna do this again? I kind of thought we uh, kind of thought we kind of thought we did that enough. Okay, no, no. Oh, really? We're we gonna do this again? No. Okay, well, that's gonna be left okay. and down. A more to the left. Okay, a little lower. A bit lower. Ah, to the right. Aim more to the right. Steady now. Did I get it? Got it. Yeah, all right. There you go. Nice. Nice. Oh, really? Are we going to do a third one? Oh, my goodness. Okay, wow. What a fun, fun mini game this is. Ay, 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 ay. Come on. Let's just move along. Move along, please. Oh, good. I guess you got it right away. Cool. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. That's that's right. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No. Far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. Okay, cool. Well, you taught her to protect herself. That's great. What is this? Is this some drink? Looks like Chuck has some booze left. Eh, I guess I'll take it. I'm not going to drink it. Just take it. It's a fifth of whiskey. I don't know, I'll give it to Chuck, I guess. Uh, let's see, what's over here? What is this over here? This little, just dark area of the... What the heck? What am I looking at? I hope we're not on this train much longer. Yeah, I hope we're not on this train much longer. Okay. Um, uh, I don't know where to go. Can, can we... There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. Why would I take the scissors? Why would I need those scissors? Oh, for Clementine's hair. Hey, Clementine. Hey. hey. Hi. I gotta cut your hair now. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. <laughs> Cause it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it, and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Okay, cut it. if we do this now? I guess not. Yep. Don't mope. It's a good thing. What an exciting episode. I'm so glad you guys, y'all get to see what me play a, a video game you where I'm just cutting this. hair. <laughs> How hard can it be? Yeah. I'm going to look like a boy. 
just now. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. She looks so different. It's amazing already. Uh... Yeah, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. That's still really long. There. All set. I thought it'd be a lot shorter than that to be safe, but I don't know. Okay. Well, why can't a walker grab that ponytail? Does it look <laughs> dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. I don't know. That's not that big of a change. I can't believe we spent time on that. It's just a, I mean, it's just a ponytail. You can, Walker could grab the ponytail. <laughs> looks exactly the same. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Her hair is a lot safer now, the game tells me. Okay, that's great. Uh, is there anything else? What am I going to look at Chuck's camp? He's I can put... I could put the scissors back, but no. All right, let's uh, let's, let's go back up front. I don't think I can get to uh, Kenny's mom here. It doesn't doesn't seem as though uh, I can get to the the next car down. I probably can, but Kenny, I need the freaking maps, dude. Can I get them now? What's your problem? And <sighs> if I get by you for a second, Kenny, can you just leave me alone? Ah. Uh. <laughs> I'm exhausted by you, Kenny. I know you're in mourning. I get it. I totally do. But man, I just need to read some freaking maps. Okay. Uh, here. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Do I? Sure. sure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Not known for its finish. No kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Oh, Kenny! Ah ha ha ha! Aha! Ah, I can uh, maybe I can get Kenny to to go out and have a drink with with uh, Chuck. Hey, Kenny. Hey. Oops. It's full of maps and documents. No, I don't care. I got to Kenny. Kenny, hey, go get a drink. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that'd help. Yeah, I think it probably would. Okay, now I can grab the freaking maps. Okay, then. Finally. Jeez, Kenny was total map blocker there. Okay, uh, let's see. So I guess we'll go over this way. Oh, he's back. That's quick. All right, Chuck, what do you got to... Anything you got to say over here? There was a map of Savannah in the cab. There we go. That's where I would look. I'll talk it over with Clementine. Make sure she's got a sense of things by the time we arrive. Good. Okay, the longest train ride in the history of uh, time. This is like, it's like, it's like real time. <laughs> That's how long this is taking. Okay, let's go. We're going to go this way. Back here and talk to Clementine again. Uh, we'll just ignore Ben and walk right on, right on by him. All right. Excuse me, Ben. It was me. Ah! Oh. Huh? I tried so hard to ignore him. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. Ah! <gasps> what? 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 I didn't know that. It's all my fault. Why was he giving them supplies? What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend. That he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. Oh my goodness. You still want to talk to me? Oh, uh, I want to throw you off the freaking train. Not really. I didn't think so. Yeah. Wow, okay. So Ben, ben was given the band of supplies. I had no idea. Okay. All right. I, I cannot believe that we're just like chill with... I mean, we're not, obviously, but, like, I can't believe we didn't make more of a big deal about that. He got Carly killed! 
Wow. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. Okay, uh, we should go our own way, or we need help to find a boat, or we should look for your parents. Let's look for our parents. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah, you need to know if they're okay, and well, if they're not, what happened to them. I'm sure they're okay. Mm. Get your hopes up. Yeah, let's, let's be realistic with her. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. <sighs> sure. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh shit! Hold on everybody! Uh oh. Something must be on the tracks. Maybe a horde? Maybe the tracks are just broken? Maybe another train? It could be anything! I have no idea! What's he looking at? What the heck? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big, uh... Jeez. Big, giant petroleum. Well, that's not gonna... I can't believe you got stopped in time. Fuck, 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 fuck! <laughs> Did I mention this channel isn't, ch isn't uh, kid-friendly? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm yeah. I'm just saying. You're stupid, Ben. Hmm. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all <gasps> Oh, Kenny's we wife died. deal with that. We I forgot. A goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's going to explode. You got to get a hold of yourself. There's a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that, and you're going to get your face chewed off. Are you guys going to be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Uh, no, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Okay, well, I guess we're going up the ladder, huh? Are we? Yeah. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. I kind of like them already. Instantly, I like them. They, they're not claiming to be, like, nice. Is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Okay. Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm only... What about when what? Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Okay. Uh... uh Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and yeah, we we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit. God damn, you guys have a kid. Clementine, what are you doing up here? What are you doing up here? Yeah, Do you good know question. How long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit. What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great. See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. 
What's your story? Uh, let's see. I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Uh, Ben is young and stupid. We just met Chuck. Kenny lost his wife. Uh, let's explain Kenny first. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know. Uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay, well, let's see. Let's start. Let's check out the generator first. It's Good empty. to know. Empty, empty generator. Okay, what about what's in here? Folks probably had their way with that van a while ago. Federal rescue truck. Can I open it? Stop signs. I'd like one of those for my house. Uh, what would I take? The tape. I guess the tape. That's about the only useful thing in here. Yeah. Okay, well, let's take a little, another look around here and see. Generator is empty. And uh, there is, yeah, there is fuel, right? There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Yeah, that's that's definitely not. This thing is mangled to hell. Yeah. No releasing it. No nothing. Yeah, that that's that's gonna be really tough to tough to break. But this thing's full of fuel, so maybe we could get, you know, use the fuel from the truck. What's that say? Whatever government work was going on here didn't seem to help. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so I don't... Hmm. I don't see anything else of real use. It seems like we're kind of boxed in in this place here. I could head down. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. <laughs> Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. All right. So we got some options, I guess. Uh, we could go up here and talk to Kenny. Kenny seems like in a really bad, bad place right now. But I think I'm gonna head over here. Let's talk to uh. Let's let's talk to Clementine. You interrogating this woman for us. Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Okay. Uh, I don't think I can talk to her separately. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Okay, where are you from? Where are you from? San Francisco. Jeez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Okay, uh, so you learned that Omid is interested in southern history, and not sure how we'll sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask Omid. He likes to break things. Okay. Uh, were they arguing? Yeah, I'm gonna go with this. Careful. She's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? Nothing. If you're going to be around for a while, be good to know what baggage you got. And maybe we won't be around for a while. Hmm. Okay, there's something. She didn't appreciate me prying her in business. Well, I want to know what's going on, you know? I'm going to walk over here and check out this, uh, I don't know, this fuel. Maybe I can get something to cut the tanker down. It don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah. yeah. All right. Come on. 
Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Okay, let's check out the train station. What bad could possibly happen, right? <laughs> I mean, we made all kinds of racket driving the train here, so if there are walkers trailing us, I assume that they'd be kind of close, but maybe we drove fast enough that they would lose hearing. Survivors inside, it says. I doubt it. Okay. No, I th thought it might say something. Okay, are we, am I just looking at this? Yeah, I am. Fine silver. Oh, cool. I don't need to. I don't need to up close look at all these things. Is there anything uh, I can look at the? Somebody must have been pretty desperate. Paint all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody must have been pretty desperate. Can I get off this? Can I just jump over? No, I'm gonna have to walk down the stairs. All right. <clears throat> Let's go down here and see. There's gotta be a door probably over here. This says no entry. What's why? Hmm. Trust. That's old. That's old. That doesn't still apply. Clementine, what the heck are you doing, Clementine? You should wait for me before trying to open uh, doors. Yeah. Sorry. Dude. Well, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Yeah, that was a pretty good reaction, Leah. Honestly, that was a pretty good reaction. Okay. Uh, let's see. Should I try to push? Let's just try to push it open. Mm, old butt. Hmm. All right. I already knew it was locked, so okay. Can I just look in the cracks? In well, I could look, kind of look in the cracks, really. Kind of could. Okay. Oh, what's this thing? Forklift. Is that what that is? Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Yeah. Okay, and that and it's, it's of course blocking the entire path. I, I could look in these windows, but eh, they seem like they're boarded up from the inside too. Okay. Oh, up here. Oh no way. I don't like where this. Is. Am I gonna put Clementine? Maybe I could look in. Ah. Uh, look in. Okay. You look in. Maybe. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds don't good. go in. Ugh. Couldn't I just get a box to stand in? Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Uh, oh, what, what do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? Oh. I think so. <laughs> How'd she reach? How'd she reach that? Well, I'll be damned. Now the doorknob was okay. What? We're just gonna continue on as if that Let's makes go. sense. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Okay, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna wrap up this episode right here. I just saw this the uh, the save thing go, and then we'll come back and we'll check out this. Uh, room. Damn, it's dark in here. Yeah, Maybe this is super creepy. The door open? And scary. That's a good idea. Like that. I'll prop it open with something. Okay, we will see you all next episode from Walking Dead. Thanks so much for spending part of your day with me. I do appreciate it. Bye, everybody.